our question is what would be remainder if the given dividend function is divided by a divisor which is again a polynomial okay let's check the concepts concept number one in the terms of numbers when a number divided by a divisor we have remainder r when the same number divided by the factor of the old divisor then the required remainder is the old remainder divided by the new divisor here the condition is new divisor should be the factor of old one for example if 100 divides a number say the remainder is 27 when the same number divided by 10 what would be the remainder here our new divisor 10 is the factor of old divisor 100 so it satisfies our condition so the remainder would be 27 divided by 10 which is nothing but 7 so we can say if old remainder is more than the new divisor we have to divide the number for the same quotient when n divided by 100 say the remainder is 7 what would be remainder when n divided by 10 but the same concept 7 divided by 10 is nothing but 7 we have to apply the same concept if new divisor is the factor of old one notice one thing if old remainder is more than the new divisor we have to divide if old remainder is less than the new divisor we can say the old remainder would be the required remainder okay now check this concept for the function when a function fx I am writing function in a capital letter just to understand that gx is the factor of capital GX if fx divided by gx remainder is rx then fx divided by gx the remainder would be nothing but rx old remainder divided by the new divisor if gx is the factor of capital GX the same as the previous one here we apply the same concept if the power of rx or the degree of rx is smaller than degree of gx then this would be the remainder we have seen 7 mod 10 is 7 in the both the cases if rx has the bigger degree or the power than gx then we have to divide again i am writing the same things rx is a smaller degree than given gx then rx is our required remainder we are going to use these two concepts in our question for solving these questions we follow few steps we try to find a simple multiple of our divisor polynomial and apply the previous concept we should know about two divisors if power of x is in descending orders all signs are positive all coefficients are one then this is the factor of x and minus one one more power if we have same power of x descending and coefficients are alternate plus one minus one then this is the factor of x and plus one so you have to notice one thing if all plus then it is minus one if all minus plus then it is plus one power of x n minus one decide x n if it is the five then this would be six okay use this concepts and important divisor in our question our question is we have a divisor x4 minus x plus x square minus x plus 1 we can say this is type 2 divisor type 2 means plus minus plus minus so this is the factor of x5 plus 1 that is the 4 then 5 plus 1 okay so we have a simplest multiple of our divisor so we have simplest multiple of our given divisor now we have to find remainder for this divisor so we have simplest divisor x5 plus 1 find the remainder of the given dividend functions by putting x5 equal to minus 1 in polynomial so we have remainder x by the multiple of our divisor so by the concept of the remainders if multiple gives remainder x then the divisor should also give remainder x if x is in the lower power if are this remainder having greater power than 4 then we have to divide it again but here the remainder is of a smaller degree than the divisor so this one is the required answer okay if you have any doubt feel free to ping me on facebook or in this youtube video thread okay thanks